In this video, I will compare Inigo versus Turbo Tenant and tell you which of these property management softwares may be best for you and your needs. So both of them help you basically find tenants, screen tenants, and help you do taxes, accounting, everything that you may want from a rental property management software. Now I'll go over which one I think is best and why. So first, let's just quickly go over what exactly you can do with them since that is, in my opinion, the most important factor. And on top of that, you have the pricing, which I'll go over later. But you can see in terms of features, the main ones on Turbo Tenant are advertising your listings, which basically allows you to find tenants. Then you can set up lease agreements. You have rental applications. You can collect rent. You have tenant screening so that you can basically find qualified tenants. And you can do accounting if you click view all features you will see that they have some more such as collecting payments so you can set up late fees auto pay you can keep track of your receipts you can set up reminders and again you have the accounting so those are the main features included in turbo tenant Comparing this to Inigo, you can see on Inigo, you can also do online rent payments, which allows you to collect payments automatically and set up late fees, stuff like that. They have online lease signing, security and cloud. There is a mobile app where both you and your renters can access Inigo for payments and stuff like that. They have listings and syndications, so spread the word about your rentals to attract more tenants. They have maintenance requests, expense and reporting. Now, one thing about Inigo, that I like a lot is this feature, the reporting. Their reporting is very advanced and very helpful in my opinion. They have renters insurance, tenant screening, forms and documents, and a bunch of integrations with, for example, QuickBooks, Zillow, and a lot of other marketplaces to basically list your properties. Now, when you look at their pricing, first I'll just quickly take a look at Turbo Tenant's pricing for landlords. You can see they have a free plan available with unlimited listings and you get applications and screening, state-specific leases, online rent collection and maintenance requests. So all of the basic features are included in the free account. Now you do need to pay fees for the online rent collection. Then the pro plan at $9.92 per month when you bill annually will get you unlimited lease agreements, the landlord forms pack, expedited rent payouts, custom screening questions and some more. Then in the premium plan, which is $12.42 per month when you bill annually, you get income verification, lower screening fees, unlimited e-signatures and waived ACH fees. So for the screening feature, for example, you do need to pay extra fees, but those are lower in the premium plan. Comparing this to Inigo, the great thing about Inigo is that it is free. Now it does have fees, but you can see there is no setup fee, no monthly fee and no contract. Now there are fees for collecting payments online, but those aren't even that high either. So really Inigo is very cheap to use and I, and I like that a lot about Inigo. You can see the online rental payment fees right here. So ACH payments free, credit and debit card payments free, single business day funds delivery free, automated debits free. Now for your tenant, the ACH payment do cost $2, then the credit debit card payments 2.99%, but that doesn't go out of your end. It basically comes on top of the rental price so that the tenant has to pay it instead of you. Now if you don't like that, then you can also choose to give them lower rent and then it comes out of your end. Now we can even get someone's criminal credit and eviction history for just 30 to $35 again on the tenant's end. So you can make that a requirement that they need to provide that in order to rent out your house or apartment. Then income verification is $10 for the tenant as well. Now you will see that none of this will cost you any money. And even for the tenant, most of it is just a one-time fee and then just a few percent, which isn't really a big deal. So Inigo is for you completely free to use, which is quite amazing. So therefore, personally, I would 100% go with Inigo. It will save you a bunch of money compared to Turbo Tenant, because not only do you need to pay for the subscriptions on Turbo Tenant, the fees are also going to cost out of your end. So in terms of both features and pricing, I think Inigo is the better software. And if you look at their G2 reviews, you can see that most people agree. Turbo Tenant here only has six reviews, but it scores only 3.8 stars out of five, which is not a great score. And comparing this to Inigo, 
You can see Inigo has 291 reviews, so nearly 50 times as much, and it scores 4.9 stars out of 5, which is a lot better. Now, if you want to get started with Inigo for free, you can use the link in the description, and through that link, you will basically be able to use Inigo for free forever, and you will also get amazing customer support, and I would 100% recommend Inigo out of these two. I would not use TurboTenant, I would personally use Inigo. So click on the link in the description to get Inigo completely for free forever. You get all of this right here for free. So all you need to do is enter your email address and then click on get started. So that concludes this comparison of Inigo versus Turbo Tenant. If this comparison was helpful, please consider leaving a like and subscribing to my channel. With that being said, I will see you in the next video.